you know, the other time I gave you update about uh, Sarah Martins, Yola Duchi, and Judy Austin. Yes, it didn't stop there. Sarah Martins said it, in, said it herself. This is not something that I'm saying. She said it herself that Yola Duchi took money. Both of them, Yola Duchi and Judy Austin, took money off people. Took their money. Told them he was going to shoot this movie, he was going to do that, he was going to direct this, he was going to be part of this. He took their money. Some of the job he did, he kept the master, you know, the recordings. He didn't release it to the owners. Money, he doesn't want to release. release. He kept it to himself. Some people, you hold them. And these people came to Sir Martin like, look, you are the only one that has contact. I mean, you connect to these people. We know that you're no longer in talking times with them, but please help. We don't want to escalate this. This man is already going through and we don't want this to now be like he holds up. We don't want to. He's already down. You see how bad it is. You see how terrible it is for you, Leduce. It's not only the divorce. He is quite unfortunate. It's unfortunate. If you, Leduce, was cutting what he was cutting, of course, you know, they say many days for the thief, one day for the owner. That's what has happened to you, Leduce. But I was just thinking, if you, Leduce, was cutting corners here and there, you know what I mean by corners, if he was benching little, 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 you know, not really making it a scene, maybe you'll be able to survive for some time. Maybe you'll be able to do it when he's 50. Maybe 55. Maybe luckily 60. And then he's already old and... What more? What energy? There's nothing else remaining. But you let Duce. Hmm. Well, what am I trying to say? Even those that you let Duce hold money, they are kind of like trying to. Re 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 they, are, they are trying to restrain themselves. They're trying to restrain themselves from taking action because they see that Yule Duce is a broken. Is, is, there's nothing working for a movie. Zero. Endorsement. Zero. Everything. Zero. Money is no more coming in. Yule Duce took this money and ran down to Abuja with Judy Austin. They took money off people. Loan. Borrow. I will do your work. Don't worry. It's okay. It's Odogu. It's this. It's that. They took money. Ran down to Abuja. Claiming politician. Using that as a threat to those that they hold. Anyway, since Sir Martin decided to put out number of Ule Duce's father, she said, he said, I gave them your father's number. Let them call your daddy. She said it. Let them call your father so your father can call you to return. If not, what will happen next? Don't say that because you also owe me money. Now, those people called. Barrage of calls. They barge Peter Duce with calls. That is why Judy Austin said something. Said, B, we not have a child that only has what she calls Amo Bingo. Mm, the one that goes from here, here, and here. Not east, west, south. Not east, west, south. Middle belt. But someone who is not bold to be stupid, but bold to be wise, cautious. We are not saints, but there should be limits to what we do anyway before proceed like and share this video tap on the subscribe button very important if you're just coming across this channel like and share this video that is how you encourage us to do more and if you want to go an extra step tap on the thanks button the one with the love and dollar sign in the middle yes love icon dollar sign in the middle tap on it to encourage this channel to do more hmm well when the call came through to Peter Duce, it was so much. The man didn't know what to do. He called Yo and said, Look, I can tolerate many things. You are my son, regardless. But this, I will not tolerate it. Well, Peter Duce definitely knows why this is happening this way. Like, Yule Duce has never been this rubbish stupid foolish useless obviously judy austin is um 
advising him wrongly. And for a woman to advise a man this way, apart from boosting your false, you know, falsifying, making it like this fake ego, pushing you, apart from that, there must be something else. Mm, there must be something else that Yule Duche believes in Judy Austin that will make him listen 100% without applying a little sense. Peter Duche believes that Yule Duche would have paid, at least if slowly, slowly, pay those people. Now, whilst we are talking about this, while they are talking about money to be returned, Judy Austin is talking about something else. D this Judy Austin is crazy. I mean, she's not normal. Pay up money. Pay up money. Tell you the duty to pay money that he holds. He say, yeah, right now, things are hard. We, are, are they going to give her money to take care of the kids? Meaning, if we return the money, what are you going to, what are we going to live on? Do you like do you understand this lady like you and the cannot return that money that's what she's saying like she needs money from them give us money give me money to like who asks you who asks you to get pregnant who asks you to have all of these children like i don't really get it they said return money he said if you a duchy returns money how are they going to get money to take care of their kids that there is no money to be returned now, we are talking about money that ranges like 4 million, 3 million, 7 million, 2 million, here and there, 500k, 50k, here and there. Yule Duchi took all of this money. Judy Austin also influenced some of this money so that he can take them. And now, this matter is complex because it involves Yule Duchi's elder sister and Pete Duchi. Anyway, with all of these things happening, Yule Duche and Judy Austin landed in Enugu. They, la they went to their father's, to, to Peter Duche's house. And, um, you know, the noise was so much. The noise was so much. Judy Austin was, her voice was so loud and it, it's a serious issue. Now, Link Duche was there, but not the other brothers. He was there. He's like, what nonsense is this? Yule Duche said, uh, leave her alone, leave her alone. What we came here for is a different thing. We are here to solve, we are here to sort out, blah, blah, blah. You know, Yule Duce is not normal. Pete Duce got angry, came out and ordered Judy Austin out. Get out of my house now. That Judy Austin has ruined Yule Duce's career. We are not talking of marriage now because we cannot blame her for ruining marriage. It's both of them. It takes two to tango. So it's not. Uh, it's like you have ruined. It's about the career. It's about finance now. Because if you lose your marriage or your marriage breaks up, at least have money to feed, have money to take care of the children. Now, why is Peter Duce hungry sending Judy Austin out? I'll tell you. The reason is this: those that Yule Duce would have gone to for help, for assistance, to help pay slowly, slowly, or even some that would say, "Okay, take this one." Judy Austin turned their back against Joel. In fact, Yule Duce is back against them. So you have no helper. You have no money. No endorsement. No movie to direct. No movie to feature in. <laughs> anyway, Peter Duce called him Yule Duce, questioned him like, look, what is going on here? Where is the money? What did you use it on? Like, I made the movie. I did this and that. Okay, if you've shot the movie if you've done what else is remaining why don't you finish the production uh, it is on the edition editing process like seriously editing level how many years how long how many months does it take to edit movie and present do you want the time you know movies you have to release it at a specific time if not somebody else will bring in another blockbuster that will you know blow and when you come with yours it's it's like bad market you give him job to do he's not ready to finish up the job well Judy Austin had been sent out, like, get out. We don't want you around here. Don't come around with your letter. We don't want to see you. 